Nick, as part of Independence, you come to a part of the country you've never been to, Tennessee, for a regular season game. What's the morale of the team as you enter Johnny Red Floyd Stadium? Well, I think it's good. I mean, it's November 1st. We got a new opportunity to start things off fresh and uh, play football in football weather and go out and make some plays today. Coach Mendenhall told me that for the most part, he thinks that the guys' minds are right and they've been putting in some extra work. What kind of things have they been doing to snap out of this four game losing streak? You know, I, I see our guys at practice just really continuing to make sure that they're looking at exactly what they're supposed to look at in terms of their keys. Um, I see them running to the ball harder than they have before. I see guys in the film room, see some seniors, you know, leading film sessions, you know, when we're not there and, you know, throughout the day between their classes. Those are the kinds of things that I see right now. No Craig Bills, no Alani Fua today. Who will start in their place on the defensive side of the ball? Um, we'll start, uh, Sky will start at free in place of, of Craig, and then uh, Fred Warner will start at Sam again in place of Alani. And those guys, you know, up to this point have done a nice job. Talking about that youth movement with uh, with Sione Takitaki and Fred Warner, who else have you seen kind of step up uh, with the opportunity that's been presented to them? You know, I think uh, Jordan Prater, uh, Dallin Levitt, uh, Kai Nakua, um, Harvey Longi. Uh, Logan Taile, you know, Travis uh, Tuiloma is a young guy. I think all those guys, kind of a core of young guys that are starting to make plays. And, you know, we need those guys to go out and make plays today. I asked Bronco Mendenhall what a win would mean to BYU. I'm going to ask you the same question. What would a win in Tennessee do for BYU today? It means that during this week at this time right now that we got a win, and that's what we need. You know, just this week and this moment right now, what we need to do is get a win right now. It doesn't To me, it means nothing more, nothing less than, you know, today right now we need to go out and play football and get a win. What has Bronco's message been to you as you've gone through some struggles that he experienced back in 2010? Just keep going, you know, just keep pushing. You know, it's part of the process. You can't cheat it. Uh, just make sure that daily and weekly, you know, we're going through the process with our guys, with our coaches, make sure the kids are learning and then, you know, getting these guys fired up to play. Just continue on, keep going. Coach, good luck today and hope you enjoy some Southern barbecue after the game. I appreciate it. Thanks. Okay.